What's up guys? Peace and light. It's Traveling Sis. If this is your first time joining the channel, then welcome. If not, welcome back family. I'm trying to get some good lighting for you guys. But um, yeah, so I am here on this beautiful beach. I'm at Kadimwi Beach right now. Just ordering some food. It's my brother's last day here in Tanzania. You guys, he actually flies out tonight. Tonight's actually his birthday too. Um, the 28th of September, Libra gang. Okay, I'm October 1st. Anyways, this video is not about that. So, I just want to thank each and every one of you who has been ordering the sea moss, you guys. We are still sold out of the purple. We got a little bit, but it got ordered up. <laughs> you know, the, the orders are rolling in, and I am so grateful. Um, and everybody, I'm going to include, I'm going to include screenshots of these, uh, these messages. But everybody is loving the product, you guys, because it's clean. You ain't gonna get no cleaner sea moss than this, all right? So it's very clean sea moss straight from here in Tanzania. And I'm just so elated that y'all are feeling the products, okay? Y'all are happy with the orders. Um, it was a little bit of a, a delay for, for a bit because if y'all don't know, it is not easy to ship out here from Tanzania, okay? But now we have streamlined the process. There's not gonna be any hiccups or anything when it comes to shipping. You're going to get your orders on time. You're going to get everything you need to get. And you're not going to have any problems with the delays in orders. And infinite thanks to all of my first order people, you know, in the first two or three weeks who have been patient with me um, during the shipping process. I even threw a couple extra pounds in for those people for waiting, you know, because it's the right thing to do. It's the right thing to do. You know, um, I didn't foresee these hiccups, um, but... Oh, this water's so beautiful. Yeah, I didn't I didn't foresee the hiccups and everything, but just as a thanks, I threw in a couple extra pounds. Um, so you know, I've been I've been gone for a couple weeks now because my brother's been out here, you guys, and I just I've been making a little bit of content, but I haven't had time to edit and post it because I mean it's been a couple years since I saw my brother and I'm trying to soak up each and every moment with him and not just be on, you know what I'm saying? Not not be online not be doing this and doing that like this is my big bro you guys this is my heart um one of my favorite people in the world so but i just want to pop in here real quick to say big thanks for everyone who's been ordering um shout out to everyone who's given me a positive review i'm actually going to be working on the website this coming week to try and see if i could put in a comment section or not even a comment section a, a section for reviews um, I'm also going to be putting a couple of the reviews up on the website as well. Big thanks for the couple people who, who actually did send me pictures of their food. No one actually sent me a video or the recipe that they use with the sea moss, which I'm disappointed because I need them recipes because not only am I trying to put it for everybody else, I need some recipes, okay? I want some good recipes. So, yes, please send me those recipes. I'm going to include my email down here, but this video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite favorite one of my favorite recipes that I've um, kind of concocted with this it is some sea moss hummus you guys with some fresh chickpeas and I add the sea moss to it it's so good oh my god it's so good so I hope you guys enjoy this recipe and if y'all try it out drop a comment and let me know how it was okay but before I go you guys I just want to let you know that we are fully stocked in the premium rainbow and the premium gold sea moss okay and if you want to place your order go to www.travelingsister.com slash sea moss and you can see you know all the all the weight varieties and everything that we have um, shipping from okay so shipping and, and handling the handling part is going to take about one week okay or or even less but we're giving it five business days for handling okay um in the shipping time once the order is shipped it should be no more than one week um i know on the website i have two weeks but shipping to the united states this only applies to the united states shipping to the u.s will only take about one week um so one week from the date that it's been shipped so you know you guys should receive your orders in time in a timely fashion and also really quickly before i forget for those of you who have, who have been trying to contact me on the contact tab or on the consultation tab that's going to be fixed too because i've been um 
you know, I've been trying to find a way to put the whole thing together to book a consultation and to contact me. And I see that I just gonna, I'm going to have to put it on two separate pages. <laughs> so I'm going to put that on two separate pages. A lot of you haven't been able to find the, the tab where or the section where you can leave me a comment or leave me a short message. And it's just, it's simply on the consultation page, but you have to scroll down under where you book a consultation and it says drop me a line okay so that's where where it's been um but yeah you guys that's it that's what i've been up to i'm gonna be posting a couple videos that me and my brother um you know have been exploring together here in beautiful tanzania and i'm gonna be doing probably just a quick little nothing nothing fancy but just a quick little interview with him um you know seeing how he liked tanzania and everything but i think my food is here so i'm about to eat Y'all already know what time it is. All right, so that's it. Love y'all, peace. All right, y'all, so these are the two main ingredients for my delicious hummus, okay? Dried chickpeas and premium rainbow sea moss, you guys. And I'm choosing the premium rainbow just because that's my favorite. You can really use any sea moss with this recipe. So what I'm doing here is I'm fully submerging the sea moss in water because um, it needs a little room for when it plumps up. So I'm fully submerging both of those because they swell to about three to four times their size, their dry size in water. So this is about an hour after I've submerged the sea moss. As you can see, it's getting nice and plump. Ain't much change in that. It's gonna take about eight hours for those to soak. But here we are after about two and a half to three hours, you guys, and this is almost ready to go. So what I'm doing here is roasting some sesame seeds because that's also a key ingredient in creating delicious hummus, y'all. And I roast them to like a medium golden brown that you see right here. So here are the chickpeas that I cook for about 30 to 45 minutes and I do a test where I smash it in my finger like this to see if it's ready and I eat it because it's delicious. All right, so here we go. Sea moss at the bottom, also roasted garlic. I forgot to take a video of me roasting this garlic, but basically I smashed gar garlic in a um, pestle and mortar and I added it to the bottom and here we go with the um, dill because fresh dill is delicious with everything. So here I am pouring in the extra virgin olive oil, which is a must for any hummus recipe. If you know hummus, then you know that's a must, okay? I also add a little bit of salt, all right? So these are quarter teaspoons of salt. I add about three of them, just to, just to give it that little kick, all right? Just to give it a little kick. And last but definitely not least, very essential to this recipe, some limes, y'all. I've sliced up three limes and I'm adding the juice of those and it's essential. You, you gotta have the limes in there, okay? Um, I've seen some people do lemon, but it just don't hit the same. Here's some water, of course, some water to, to loosen up the consistency and blending that bad boy up. As you can see, the sea moss is going first. Bye-bye. And here we go. Some delicious, creamy sea moss hummus, you guys. I had to sprinkle the fresh dill on top because why not? And then I added some sriracha because my brother bought me some sriracha and it just goes perfectly with it. And here is a picture of one of my other favorite dishes I like to make. I just roast some vegetables real quick and throw it in some noodles and then throw that hummus right in there and mix it up. Y'all, it's 
bussing. I'm telling you, you have to try this. If you don't try this, at least try making the sea moss by itself. But I'm telling you guys, you will not be disappointed with this. And please let me know if y'all actually try this recipe. You will not be disappointed, okay? Drop a comment. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, okay? I love you guys so much and thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to go on TravelingSister.com and order your sea moss today, okay? Love you guys. Peace.